are. Everything looks the same here, where we left off. So this is the gatehouse, and the walls at the front. And as we enter, we can see the progress I've made. So also where we left off. Uh, you have a bunch of bookcases. All right, cool. Yes. Yeah, so I've um, I finished more of this wall off camera. I've leveled this whole section. This whole section was a bit higher. Uh, kind of actually lined up with that. Um, I've removed that just because I'm going to have a little bit lower than where it was. Um, sort of plan a little bit of stuff on the walls here. And I built this entire wall over here. And this is both, both sides of it. So if we run over here, you can see um, I've done both the inner and outer wall going all the way down to the bottom. Um, and then I wasn't exactly sure how I was going to do this yet, and I figured I would do that on camera anyway. And then I did a little bit of planning here. I'll probably adjust some of my original plans uh, for how this wall is going to work. Because uh, right about here is where there's going to be like a, a crane that will be able to go down and pick up goods from the road that will eventually be down there and then bring it up to the castle. Without having to go through the front door, you can use a crane to uh, bring the goods up. So I want to have a structure in the wall for that. So it's going to, the building itself is going to go a little bit more in to the, uh, so here's the regular wall um, that comes this way. And I'll probably actually undo this and maybe style this terrain slightly different. But so the wall is going to connect there, building here, and I was thinking I might have the building come out a little ways. Um, I don't think I wanted to necessarily go all the way down, but I guess if I have it go too out, like I have here, then it might actually go all the way down. Um, all the way down to the bottom. Not sure which one would look better. Um, having it be on, on the cliff with a crane going down, or having the building go out some. Because then it will give me a little bit more range, because I don't know how big the crane is going to be. But, so, we'll have to think about that. Uh, but yeah, so I've, I've expanded out this stuff. Um, originally, I was thinking this tower in here in the corner was going to be too big if I made it be that size. But now that I have the other walls, it doesn't seem as big. It doesn't seem too bad. Um, and the inside of here is going to be inside the castle. I'm probably going to have, I'm thinking about having a stables on this side um, against the wall. Um, but I haven't figured, I haven't put that all in yet. Okay, so now that we have all that settled, um, I was actually thinking about this wall here, and I, instead of making it be like the other one over here where it's just like a straight diagonal, I had a kind of like a curve which makes this whole path confusing to make. So I think I might change this to be either squared off here, or Make this be diagonal and then follow the same pattern over there. So let's let's get over there. Take a look. So I come up here. Oh, one more. So up here, this part gets a little confusing because it's it's a little weird because I have it like banking in like that. Um, but it's not like a huge curve, so it's not really obvious that it's a curve. It just seems weird. Um, and then over here it gets complicated. Like, how do I make this? This part look right because it comes straight out and then I tried to curve it or try to like angle it but it says it's doing a weird curve that way or I guess this way for you um, it seems awkward to me so I'm considering moving in these to be just a regular diagonal like that as opposed to the angled what do you guys think you got do you have an opinion I think I just heard chicken die Um, or, or I have this square off, and there's just a bunch of city wall up here. I guess that's the easiest thing to do, so let's do that first. Oops. And we'll see what that looks like. So... Try to, yeah, exactly, yeah, yeah. So we can do this. Um, so that would be what this kind of space looks like. Like that. And then, um, there'd probably be some buildings here. Um, 
Like there, I'm going to have sort of the rooftops on top of the stable is leading up against the building. Um, and then I might have to do something similar here, or maybe this would be like there'd be this would all go down all the way down to wherever the road is going to be. And then there's a building in the middle here um, that might be separate from the actual main keep in the middle. There's not as much room in the middle as I wanted, but I guess the keep can be a tall, uh, tall structure, so I'd still have plenty of space in there probably. Um, but, so now I'm trying to decide if I want to have this be squared off like this. And I guess that leaves room for some other sort of building inside of this. Um, I don't know. Undecided. Um... So it'll, this is sort of the squared off version, and then let's run over here and look at the diagonal version that I have over here, kind of what that looks like. So here is the straight, straight on, and then it turns, and so it would be diagonal like this. Thank you for the follow, zombie boy, 19. Sorry it doesn't show up in chat. Oh, there you go, there it goes, delayed. Um, the squared off version doesn't look as weird as I thought. Okay. Right. So this is the diagonal one. And then the squared off one, which we could leave. So it's it's a squared off because I have a curve. Where it's it's like... Oh, that was close. Where it's like a, more of a curve that goes here. And then this underneath... Um, you know, this path is here right now. So I, I think I might drop down some of this to be on a lower level here. So this could be a two-story structure built into the wall uh, here, possibly. And then this is the barracks. And so the barracks probably will have a main door like in here, possibly. Um, and then there could be structures on either side and then sort of like a little road that runs to the middle. Um, it could be another interior room, uh, since it is, yeah. Okay, all right, we'll, we'll go with it, we'll go with this. Okay, all right, so we'll, we'll go with this plan. Um, so that's gonna line up with that, going across there. There's an entrance to here, which lets you get into here. Um, so I think that the, the main path is gonna come up to this level, and then have an entrance here. These things are in the way right now, but these are, this is all the blocks from the stuff I cleared. Um, but I can rearrange that. So there's going to be an entrance here, somewhat of a platform, so this will come down a little bit more. And then maybe gradually it'll work its way up to this same level. Um, and then I might do possibly hills around, although I think they mostly just flattened it when they were building everything. Okay, so let's build another floor here. Um, this one's going to be, I guess this is three... If they're all going to be three stories, or three uh, three blocks high, then it might um, it might make sense to have the path go up one more so that the ground is lined up more with this. Although, right now this is all just stone, so I probably would actually put in dirt uh, for a lot of it. So I think, we're, I think we're okay with having it not quite lined up right now. So we can head over this way. Take this stuff out, and then inside of this building, I think we'll um, it'll still be a couple floors lower down as well, so we can actually clear out a bunch of this if we want. We can work on the on the bottom part of the barracks and try to kind of transition from here and these and this structure here and so on. Those are my pick is doing good. Uh, let's actually drop off some of these blocks that we brought from downstairs. There's also a little bit more room. And then we can start putting in some of these walls too. So this is going to be. Oh, let's make a day. But right, so I'm going to have a big tower there in the corner that lines up with that. Uh, some sort of tower structure over there. The uh, grain or whatever, like the supplies uh, crane thing. This is the barracks gatehouse. And then I'm going to have stables in here. And then. 
possibly one of the structures over here might be like a galley or something. Or maybe that's inside the barracks. Uh, is it galley if it's... I mean, is it just on a ship? The the place where they eat. I don't know if that's a different term if it's not in a, in a ship. But let's take out some of this to put in another floor. And then I could still have arrow slits over there. I think that this is high enough up from the ground. But that will still work. And then I'll probably lay out, once I get some ideas of the structures in the around the corner, or on the outside, then I'll lay out sort of the foundation for, yeah, galley's only a ship. So like uh, the mess hall, I guess. Uh, yeah, myself. Um, but then I'll then I'll lay out like the, the sort of the foundation plan for the actual keep itself, and then we'll get an idea of how that's all going to fit together. Here, so we so slowly take a little bit more out here as well. All the way over to the wall, probably, or at least up to that. I don't know if I'll fill in this space in here, might be for secrets, so I'll, I'll leave that um, just on its own for now. And I think that this probably is. Okay, so that's that's near the outside, but not quite uh, visible from the outside. So. Can I invite you? I cannot. This is um, it is a private server just for Scotty and I and some of our internet friends. It's uh, otherwise not open for the public right now. Okay, so I'm lined up there, so that's going to be where the wall is. Um, so let's grab actually a bunch of this dirt, and we can actually, if we're going to, yeah, sorry. Um, so this is going to be raised up, then we can actually start laying in some of the dirt, um, at least near this spot. I don't know if I'm going to keep it, oops, if I'm going to keep it raised up in the whole area or not. But for now we'll do that, and maybe we can get some grass growing. Um, I might have varying varying stuff. So for now, we'll just do that. And then let's bring it over to where the grass is. So the grass can hang out. Alright, and put in the wall here. Let's get that cracked ready. And so the middle. Is there an easy way to get, figure out what the middle is without counting it? Yes. We go inside of it. One more. And then we'll go through here. Thank you for the follow, Slim Jim. Welcome. Actually, would this even be the middle? I don't even know if this is the middle. Oh, you're not supposed to be here. Thank you for the follow. Daz, welcome. There's a creeper in my base. Not invited. Apparently it's too dark over here. There we go. There's no torches, that's why. Okay. You need to go away, sir. Oh, he's dead. Okay. Alright, anyway. Uh, <laughs> let's find out where the middle is. So I guess we'll have to count it out. That's a shame. So this is the edge of the building. Um, so to signify that, we will say that's the edge of the building. So that's just so we know where the edge is. So we'll do count blocks across, uh, including the walls. So one, two, three, 
4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. 22. All the way up to here. Okay. So, we have 1, 2, so I want to do uh, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So this is the opening. Um, so you can put in the walls here and the walls actually I'll just put in uh, I'll leave out the crack stuff for now I'll come back to the crack stuff and put in this for now put in the whole floor lined up with this um, so again this is just gonna be a little open area that will might have secrets to tie into later for now it's just just sitting there like that Tomorrow on my channel, uh, the if you're watching this live, um, there's going to be a uh, um, Untold Stories 4 videos are going to start coming out. If you're watching this on YouTube, they're probably already out. You should go check them out. We, uh, we had a lot of fun. We streamed that this weekend. Went pretty well. It's always cool. We had uh, the creator of the map we had in the stream, so it's always kind of fun to watch his reaction to... The different things we're running into. Okay, so that's the edge of the building. Um, so this is the edge of that building, and then there's this structure here. So, but I'm going to treat that building as a separate one, except maybe some secret door stuff in here. But for now, we'll leave that as is. Let's just see. Yeah, I'm glad that the emeralds um, are are showing up better. I'm going to be slightly vague, um, just so I can, because you never know. You you don't want spoilers, you know. Um, but yeah, I'm glad that uh, it's going. Most likely better than last time. Okay, so here's the front door. Um, let's go ahead and uh, I guess we'll light up this bottom area. Just so that they don't have creepers spawning inside the basement. That's probably good enough. So then that could be a secret door into that area over there. And we can come in here and put in these. So this is going to be the floor. I mean, I mean the other option is I can make the the first floor be a little bit taller. Is there a reason why I want to do that, or just keep it all three? I guess I can make the first floor be a little bit taller. So let's remove all this. And I, might, I could even go five. I could go just crazy and just do five. Um, okay. Oh my goodness. So we're gonna go lower than that. So this here would be, um, if it was three high. And so then that's gonna be if it's, uh, you know, like that. There we go. So now we're gonna make the first floor be a taller one. Um, it's where we can have some more, like not just bunks, but we can have some other stuff. Um, so these torches are sort of useless right now, but it's okay. <laughs> um, we'll come back to them. Cause we're gonna have more floors below it. So this one is gonna be maybe where the mess hall is, or at least like some of the other facilities and stuff. Cause we're gonna have a bunch of bunks up higher up. Um, and I also need to figure out how the how the stairs will transition onto this floor. Um, I'm not sure how that is going to work quite yet. We'll see. But we'll start out by putting in the floor. Probably killing a couple cows that are in the way. Get some goodies. Oh, I guess I'm full on inventory space. There we go. Oh, and I also want to make sure that I have a way to uh, either even readjust or, you know, adjust the, where these 
the secret passages are, or uh, or just keep it in the same column. So we'll see that once we get working on the structure for this floor, um, then we can work on some of that, some of the details. I feel like I should make it be day. I think it's about to be night. Yeah. And then we can also get rid of some of our dirt and get some uh, some more blocks for inside. And then depending on uh, how close this is to the surface, I may or may not have arrow slits. I guess I can still have arrow slits. I might not have windows. We'll see. Keep, uh, I don't think I need to keep any dirt right now. There we go. And actually, up some of that. So then this one, I'm actually gonna be then lowering this in this particular area to line up better with this building. So I might lower the whole floor and then I don't know yet. I'll probably do path blocks, I guess. So I'll change this out to be grass. Um, so then this whole area here will be the, this height well, with grass being in there. Took away all the grass already, or all the dirt. But I'll come back to getting some inventory space in a second. Yeah. So the uh, for my my household, we uh, this weekend we played, um, or we had, there was some local college hockey that I attended. We didn't do so great, but it was I still had fun um, and. On the way out from the uh, from the second game, I went by. I really like the popcorn there. And uh, as I was going by the concession stand, they had extra popcorn that they weren't gonna. They didn't want to keep because they, they didn't sell, and they had just some extra made. So I got some free popcorn. It was super cool. Thank you for the follow, Jack. Appreciate that. We're on, on our way to our goal for this week, and then also in general. I'm trying to break the 1,000 mark. Pretty cool. Matthew, welcome. Welcome and thank you. Oh my God! Thank you for the stream, or thank you for the thank you for the stream. Thank you for the uh, follow. So I'll put these in here, um, and then I'll take a peek. And once I have the floor in, we can change from to be cracked. We could, yeah, free popcorns, awesome. Alpha Q. Oh my goodness, I don't know Alpha Q. Oh, that means. Is it like a. Maturian candidate, like unlocking the uh, the whatever thing. I don't understand. Is that a thing? Okay, so build that in, and then over here. So I'm gonna try and do like secret doors and stuff. So this this cubby in here might be a good spot for secret door. There's gonna be a structure there, and then this is the barracks here. Uh, I probably don't want to do that. <laughs> I probably probably will not do that. Whatever, whatever it is that you're trying to get me to say, no. But thank you. Um, I think I I think I might figure it out. I think I might have gotten it. So this is the secret area here. So I, I will, just so I'm aware it's there, I will leave an opening there. We'll fill that in there. And uh, this doorway, I guess I'll have an actual like doors, doors there. I won't just have it be open. So it'll be like that with double doors. Finish off over here. And here, right, yeah. You like my glasses, well thank you. I like them too, I, I can see. <laughs> That's the most important thing. Because if I take them off, uh, I mean, I could probably play Minecraft, but I wouldn't be able to see my little hotbar or see your, any of your text. Okay, so then also so we know where this secret door is. So this is probably going to be a secret space here. So we'll leave that open. Um, oh, that's fine. Yeah. Uh, you are you are the moderator. Um, you you will most likely not go too far. <laughs> we, had, uh, we had some people... At the stream on Sunday, that were uh, 
definitely on my uh, on my nerves. <laughs> uh, so for now, I'll just put these spamming in here, and then we can uh, come back to that. All right, so this is gonna be the doorway to come over there. Um, your horse died. Oh no! In uh, in Minecraft or in real life? I don't have a horse in either. I actually, I don't think I have any horses on the server. I will need some because I'm gonna put it in a, a barracks here. But uh, I'm gonna sort of come back to later on some of the uh, some of the population that I'll need. So like the the horses and um, what else? Like I'll, I'm gonna have villagers in certain spots and things like that. It died. Oh my goodness. I don't know if that's uh, possible. It seems like a not possible thing. Do, 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 do. Thank you for the follow, D for life. Welcome to the stream. All right. Uh, so our inventory is not great, but we're going to put down a bunch of blocks here in a second, and then that will help with our inventory issues. So eventually this will all be glass or grass here. Um, so at the very least, there'll be a path that comes out this direction. We'll come back to that. Thank you, Gigi Bonzig, for being awesome. And I'm, and the internet has lost privilege for having chat on the screen. And um, one thing I was thinking that'd be a cool feature, and I you do it just in your bot, I guess, maybe I don't know, um, where like they would be. Like a delay for for messages, like for people that are not like new accounts or like new to your channel, you could have that delay, but then otherwise there wouldn't be a delay. Seems like that should be a thing. I don't know. Maybe just me. So this will eventually be path blocks here, and then I'll have structures on either side. I think that this is going to be right against the wall, so we're going to have paths going along here. Um. Yeah, right. Yeah, so there's regulars, right. And But it should be that, like, the chat messages, like, if you're a regular, you can chat, like, fast like everybody else. But then if you're if you're new, then, you know, then you have to wait. You have to, you know, not not be able to type so quick or whatever. Because otherwise, then it kind of renders the, the like, the on-screen text stuff to be useless because um, it displays before your moderators even have a chance to read it. So if you're watching Scotty Bot, which you're not, then there might be something you could add. <laughs> uh, I gotta go find that mixer suggestion box. Yeah. Well, yeah. As a, I mean, if it was a built-in thing to mixer, what actually what I'm thinking about, is I'm tempted to to see if I don't think it's out there. It's sort of like a a ginger ale raid. Whoa! It's public time. Welcome, welcome ginger ale. Welcome, brother Todd. Let me uh, preemptively make a day, just to get ready for. The raid video so that I don't get killed by a creeper. <laughs> Thank you for the raid, Ginger Ale. Welcome, Raiders. Welcome, Firefox265. Welcome to the stream. You are 100 less than a full year of days. Is that why you chose that number? I don't know. I'm not sure. Uh, let me play our raid video for you guys. Thank you for the raid. Let me, oh, let me pause the music before I get to the other music. And let's see what happens when the boat arrives. Welcome, Raiders. Thank you very much for the Rage and Drill. Appreciate that, as always. And welcome. I uh, thank you for the follow, uh, Speed Demon. We're making a castle. Uh, so this is actually the, the outer walls of the castle. We're going to have a... There's the gatehouse. Here's the barracks. Can't really... It's mostly on the other side. 
In fact, I need to just... This wall is completely void of... Um, of the cool blocks. So I need to think about that. But actually, I was just thinking about something else I needed to change. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, there's eventually going to be a keep inside the middle here. Um, and the middle doesn't look as great. As the, the outside has more interesting looking things on it. One thing I just remembered I was actually thinking about doing. So, I have secret doors that are going to be related to here and here and then there. Um, and if we go upstairs in this building, which isn't... There's not an easy way to get there right now, so let me go through here. <laughs> go up two floors, and I think I can get in from there. Yeah. Welcome. Hello. Hello. Uh, relieved bench. There we go. For some reason, I was having a problem with that. So here's some extra space here that is kind of awkward given these stairs. So I was thinking about putting in a wall here. So I might actually move this wall out. Move the all wall out one more. So that actually gives me an entire one one wide space in here to do secret doors and anything else. Um, so I think I might do that. So let's put in a wall here. And then we're going to kind of style it to be... Um, why do I have this open here? I forget. I uh, kind of style it to be... Uh, um, you know, cracked and stuff from this side, and then we can hollow out the wall uh, as much as we want. Yes, this is the Team Yes patron server, or rather Minecraft server. It is a closed, closed for the public. But you can enjoy it on either my YouTube channel or live, like right now. Okay, so let's put in some uh, uh, welcome kin. Welcome to the stream. Uh, if you're still around, I know you usually have to do um, adult adult, uh, you know, working time, um, um, ginger ale, but if you're around still, what were you up to? What were you, what were you playing? Um, let's also do, so I mean, I kind of do that all over the place, but I want to style some spots so that we have some of the, uh, crack bricks and stuff like that. And eventually I can have secret doors, secret tunnels that will go all the way through that wall. Um, was just, uh, playing... Uh, Turing test. Not sure. I'm familiar with that one. And then poker. Oh, cool. Um, you're doing okay. I am doing I'm pretty good. It's a Monday, um, but uh, but I woke up and you know it was a pretty good morning. I had some coffee and feel pretty refreshed. Um, and then this wall we're going to move out. So as I'm building this one out, I will um, I'll start putting in um, some of the different crack stuff as I go as I build it. Some of the crack bricks. So we're gonna extend this wall out one more just to give us some space to kind of mess around with uh, some of the different options. Um, so we have some extra extra space in the wall for secret doors and everything. Uh, that's one of my favorite parts about everything I build <laughs> is secret doors and uh, redstone. Redstone. There won't be probably as much redstone contraptions in some of these secret things, just because they take up a lot of space. So I might just do like a here's a painting, walk through the painting. Here's just, now you're in a secret door, but. Turing test, is that the space puzzle game? Ooh, space puzzle game. That sounds pretty cool. I don't think I have that one. So we're just kind of building this up. I'll build it up to that same spot, and then we'll build the rest of it. This might be too much cracked stuff. We'll see. All right, and then over here. So this this wall right here isn't real big, so I'm gonna extend this out again here. So this is gonna be empty space between the two walls, so that I can have secret passage from there all the way over to that thing, and then also that might connect up with something else and whatever things like that. Um, so let's put in some cracked stuff over here and there. It is. Cool. It's really good. All right. Cool. Well, that's good to know. I might uh, have to remember to check that out on... Um... Yes, I do like puzzles. I haven't done a puzzle game. I, I was playing Mist 5 for a little bit, but I didn't um, I didn't like it as much, I think. And so I haven't really gone back to it in a little bit. Um, but I do have... I also have a handful of other puzzle games. Um, I just don't have a lot of extra time. And now I'm so excited about this project that I haven't gotten back to anything else. So this approach makes it a little bit tricky to work with because <laughs> you have trying to uh, 
I already put in the randomness here, so I have to build around all of those. You personally are very bad at puzzle games. Oh, yeah, Mist is a yeah, Mist is real fun. The it was uh, so I was playing the Mist, um, uh, Mist Five. I played Mist the original, and they've updated that one, so that was a lot easier to play. Um, but then um, I played. Uh, um, I tried to do Ribbon, but then it just kept on crashing. And then I tried. Um, I was playing Mist 5, and I guess there wasn't a 3 or 4 on Steam. So I got kind of bummed out by the whole plan. The whole plan was to do Mist 1 all the way through, and then you know play them all on stream and everything. But they they weren't really updated in the same way that the original Mist 1 was updated to work better on computers and stuff. But how do I get a face cam? Um, so first step is to get a webcam. Um, and then I'm using OBS. Um, so if you're on, I'm not, there might be a way to somehow do it uh, if you're on like Xbox or whatever, but at least on PC where I'm on, um, I can um, just in OBS is the software free on the, free online for the PC and probably Mac too, I don't know. Um, then you can um, uh, you know, just add in a webcam. You just, you just say add a video source um, is the general hint, and then the other thing I would recommend is just if you Google it, then there's probably a. So if you're if you're on Mac, let's say, say, how do I add face cam in OBS on a Mac? And then there's probably a whole web page just for that. Um, there's everything is everything's out there on the internet, but that's yeah, that's the basic thing is I'm using OBS, and it has the built-in features. Uh, in fact, I even have when I stream board games. I'll have like three, what, three three webcams set up? Yeah, I have three webcams set up so I can get all the different angles of the action. People playing the board games and all other stuff. Yes, sorry, welcome, welcome so savage and also uphill cheese, welcome to the stream. Oh yeah, all right, so I remember what I was talking about. Um, so I was thinking it'd be cool if there was a bot um, where you could subscribe um, to uh, people you trust. Um, and so I could say, like, All right, I trust Indrail, and, and her mods have good judgment. And so then if they ban somebody, that they would also be banned in mine. I think that would be cool. I think somebody should, uh, this guy should add that. That would be cool. <laughs> like, you wouldn't want to do it for everybody, because there might be some, some streams or some uh, channels out there that are too aggressive, or they're, they joke ban people, maybe? I don't know. Um, and you wouldn't really want that. Anyway, just a thought. So now this is the open spot. So this I'm just going to dig all the way out, um, all the way down, just so I know that this is an open spot. But let's actually, like I guess, set it to dig day. So we can plan that into some of the builds for some of the secret passages and things like that. Um, it, that not all of this is going to be totally built in. So there's some of the floors are don't have this extra wall here yet. But so if anybody is interested in making a mod like that, that would be cool. Yeah. Why reinvent the banning wheel? Yes. I think we, uh, I think I understand what you're saying. <laughs> so this will be here, and then, so we just keep on doing that back and forth. Yeah, well, yeah, and the thing is that, like, if, if you get, I feel like the trolls and, you know, the people that get banned are like, well, that's fine, there's lots of channels I could just go to. But if they get banned from all of them, I don't know how easy it is to just remake a new account, though. I guess that's the other part. So I have to think about that. But yeah, I don't know exactly how to make bots for Mixer. Otherwise, I would be tempted to do it. Although, again, I don't have any time to do it. I have too many other projects. Yeah, I think I own that game. <laughs> I haven't, uh, I haven't made a plan yet to, to play it. Is it really, is it good? Is it real good? Um, I think I do have that. I don't remember which one that is. I own, I own a number of puzzle games. Um, so I think I, I already told you about that. I think um, I would just recommend googling it. It'd be the easiest way to 
to get it set up for you. Do, 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 do. There we go. And then this is actually, this is gonna be right out into the secret area there. And then over here we can do the same. And then we'll build in this false wall. So then in here you can get into the secret area. Like that. And then there's also, I'll leave that open there too. But Hello, relieved bench. Um, so we're going to put in just a wall here, and then we can add in some of the extra uh, styling for it. And then we need to have somehow stairs connecting up to all that. Brother-in-law just played it. Cool. Yeah, is it um, is that the ones that are it's made by the people that made Mist? I forget. Hello, uh, called Path. Welcome. Uh, keep it open. And for now, I'll leave... Like, I won't close off this entrance. Or maybe I should just so I have an idea of how to style it. It doesn't make sense. Um, I have told you. If you ask again, this is your warning. Never mind. You're banned. Okay. <laughs> no warning for you. <laughs> yeah. I. Yeah. Basically. You made the right call. As always. Yeah. It's a Monday. Uh, but yeah. So I think that would be... Uh, I think that'd be interesting. Some of these different ideas we have. All right, I know I won't have time to do it, but that'd be cool. So, all right, so it'd be a two wide, regular door here. Let's, I guess, let's style the some of the crack stuff. Dude, and over here, we'll do some of these guys. We'll do one there, and a crack there, and a crack there. First day back at college, yeah. Actually, yeah, so my, my wife works at, she teaches at a college nearby. And um, yeah, she's back at school today. Um, kind of stressed out about being back at school. But she made it, she, I think she was able to sleep, okay. So it's all good. Um, yeah, so this wall, I guess, so this one, the way, having a secret whole wall on this side doesn't give me a lot of options for that. So what I might actually do is like, I have the space to play around with. Thank you for the follow. Uh, called Pat. So I have that space to have secret doors, but also I can still have, like, a window area. So the it can come out towards the outside and have a window area. Um, start of the new semester. Yes, so exciting. Yeah, I, I always really enjoyed that. I always started in a new semester and stuff. It's cool. Um, so let's go inside and let's figure out kind of where the stairs are going to be. We're going to start... Oh, that's not the right spot. We're going to start with the uh, stairs and then try to plan from there. We're running out of time already. The streams go so quick. Um, okay, so this is this stairs go all the way up. Here, the stairs will go down. So let's make enough of a platform that we can get around. Start back last week. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I like, uh, like little kids. Yeah, yeah. Um, I don't know what those words are that you typed in. Um, so let's go here. And we'll make this be a path. And we'll actually, most likely that's not going to be enough space. Um, because it's not, it's a taller room. College age. Oh, they started early. Earlier than, uh, than our school. It's interesting. I think we're going to have the stairs go this direction. On this floor. Uh, just to warn you. Um, if you don't, if you don't start making any sense then you're probably going to end up angry, angering my mods. So I would recommend making sense. Um, okay. So if we go this direction, we might... I might take out this one, possibly, depending on how it's all set up. So we're going to have the stairs go that direction. So maybe we'll leave this here. We'll see if I... I can't really reach it. Maybe we'll build that back in. We do have slabs already. Good. Do, 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 do. Okay. Okay. So I have the stairs come this way. So slabs here. No, I think we're gonna have to remove some of that stuff. Um, these, and then I guess we can't, well, I'll leave it. It won't put in uh, cracked stuff quite yet. Okay, now we'll do a cracked and then a regular. And then, oh yeah, we definitely have to uh, <laughs> take that out. Here, here we go. Okay. And then, uh, regular slabs. Okay, there we go. 
and fill this in. And then again, this might be possibly where the uh, the the secret area entrance is. We'll see. But so now, how does it work for up here? So this is not a lot of space here. So let's take this out. Um, we can. I mean, we can leave that in. It's not functional for an arrow slip when you're up there. But at least you can, I guess, see it from the other direction. Or like when you're outside, you can see that. So here you can still shoot out. There is for light. Okay, cool. Um, so for now, we'll just put a torch in here. I don't know quite what the lighting's gonna be like everywhere, but this allows you to go uh, from this floor. So if you're out coming out across there, or you know whichever direction, here's the way down. Uh, for now, we'll put another torch in there. Um, I may consider putting in a railing there, um, or not. I don't know. Well, I'll leave it open for now. And then this is the little area over here. Good. Okay. So this now we can actually get up and down between these floors. Um, so now this, let's take a peek out here. Where is the ground? Okay, so here, so there's there's some ground, but this is still fairly high up. So we could still do arrow slits in here, possibly. Um, although, you know, depending on what we do with the space, we might we might not want to. We also want to keep in mind these. Thank you for the follow, DJ Pug Love. Pugs are pretty cool. I can relate to that. All right, um, so maybe secret doors in here. So this space might be used up by that, possibly. Um, maybe. Okay, so that's good. Now we can get up and down. Let's go back up here, and I need to put in the false wall. I think on the on this level here. Yeah. So this thing needs to have a wall put in. And then we can add in crack bricks as we go. And we also can. Um, Come back through and um, add in some like windows that will look out this direction. So there'll be a, an area where the secret wall stuff won't really be occupied. There won't be secret wall stuff, I guess, at that point. Um, so we're going to go here and one right there. And then let's go one there and two there. One there. Two there. Okay. There we go. Perfect. So, this might be a good spot for a window thing to be put in. So we can just go like that. And actually, I mean, this could also be another entrance into the secret wall uh, also. So you can come over here to look out the window. Um, I have no stairs. Yes, so big, the castle. Yeah, it's real. It's real big. Uh, yeah, this is gonna be. It's it's a work in progress. So that's the back wall. The side wall is gonna be some towers and stuff. And there's gonna be a big, huge keep in the middle. And then that is. Uh, and there's also a village. You can't see all of it really here, but there's a village out here that I'm working on building. It's gonna be a pretty big project. This is dark over here. Okay, I don't want bad guys to spawn. Um, let's also make it day. Looks like it's starting to be sunset. All right, um, so the stair blocks that we made. So here's the window to look out. So you can look out and see stuff. We'll see how that looks like on the outside also. Um, but then here potentially could be a secret door. So I might have a button on one side that there, there's enough room here so I could actually do a sort of a piston uh, piston thing. So there might be a button to actually get into the secret wall from here. Um, but for now, uh, there's no secret opening. I guess I can remind myself that there's a this could be a secret here. So I'll keep that open just for, there might be a secret entrance into there um, or on this side. So I'll keep both open. So that way when I'm building the passageways in here and over here, I can keep in mind that there might be some redstone there. Uh, let's take a look underneath here. And where does this line up? Okay, so yeah, so this is also, this could also be a good spot, same thing, same idea. Um, so I'll keep the sides open again, just so we can kind of be aware um, that this could be a connecting thing. And the window, look, again, looking out. Uh, let's see if that looks stupid from the outside.
Maybe, yeah. Um, if we have more of them, or if we adjust these to not look just to, like open like that. So let's go, let's change it up a little bit. Uh, we can take the stairs now. So let's try a different shape. Um, so this one we can go, no, I guess there's stairs there, so we, we don't have as much space to work with, but we can do something, if we have it on the, on the inside, does that make it any better? So we can do that. Um, we could also have it be the top parts are open, maybe uh, some iron bars or wooden fences, could do. Yeah. Um, we could take these out. So we can put these in. Um, and then if we, what if we put these back to be the other way? But yeah, maybe I'll, I'll, I'll check the fences, fence idea. So then this you can look at, you still can't jump out of it, which is kind of what I was hoping for. Um, so that might look better for a window. Let's try that first. And then I might add in like the fences and stuff you were saying. So this we can have it be a little bit taller. And so that it's actually sharing the floor and ceiling right there, but that's that works out okay. So then these go here. Not quite. There we go. There we go. Let's go outside. Uh, nope, this is a uh, it's a private server just for some of our, my internet buddies and I. Okay, so that is uh, better. Um, yeah, so the information, yeah, the TBS. But if you if you do want to, I put in this thing. So if you're interested in watching the whole series of this particular server and my, my gameplay on it, that is the playlist. Um, iron bars. Uh, I can put iron bars across the whole thing. Let me, I mean, not the, not the very top part, I guess, now that I put those in. Let's take a look. So if we do that, so you can still look out. Thank you for the follow, modern ear. It's pretty cool. Interesting name. Um, so we're gonna, we're gonna reverse these two. So we'll see if that might look make the other side look better or not. In fact, let's actually do that. Uh, for this one. So, we're going to put in the stairs on the other side, put in the iron bars, and then break this. Okay, so that looks better there to me uh, than that one. So having them reversed, let's see if that is cool still on the inside. And I can put more of those windows in, like, where possible. Like, with the stairs here, that makes it a little bit more complicated to, for putting that in, but... Um, so that's the, the old version. Let's look at the, the new one up here. I think it looks cool enough. Yeah. That adds a new texture to break up. The, yeah, I agree. I agree. Okay. So let's try to get... Ah, yes, I did. Okay. So let's put in these that go in the other direction. And like that. And we're good to go. Okay, cool. Um, so in some of the spots, I can do that. Um, so here there's stairs, and then there there's stairs. So I can't really do it there. I could do it there and there, but that might be weird. Um, so I could just do those two in the middle. And so for each of the floors, you're able to look out in the middle, I guess. And here there's going to be... Uh, actually, I'm going to have a road here. So I guess we don't have to worry about that exactly. Uh, let's go ahead and put in some of this structure here. So this is going to be where the wall is, coming here. And then the structure is going to, I guess, start from here over. And maybe it'll stick out a little bit from the wall to make it more obvious. You have been... Um, oh yeah, cool. Well, that's good to hear. You've been watching since I started the castle. Well, that is cool. Yeah, I've been... Uh, pretty cool project. I'm enjoying this one. Thank you for the follow, um, uh, DX, 
uh, is that is it like dry dry hacker maybe? Have you heard of Herobrine? I have. Yeah, that's the one that they keep on. Is it always removing or always adding to the server? Oh no, ghost blocks. Where's the ghost block? Oh, it's right here. Somewhere in here, there's a ghost block. I don't know where it is. <laughs> I can't find it. Oh my goodness, where is it? Oh, it's right here. Okay. Um, yeah, I've heard it here. I've heard of here, Brian. Uh, also, thank you for the follow. No, no, I pronounce your name. Uh, X or S Osprey. Osprey. There we go. You're afraid to play Minecraft? Oh, cause it here, Brian? Nah. I mean, you can't be. It's fine. Um, but I wouldn't. I would recommend that you can, you can take it. I'm sure. AJ. Okay. Cool. Well, welcome to the stream. We're gonna be ending out uh, in a little bit. I just do uh, kind of short streams during my lunch breaks. My lunch break was a little bit um, later today than it usually is. Okay, so we have our grass now, so we can build path blocks later. Um, we're going to go ahead and I guess start building on some of this wall. So these actually are okay where they are um, now. They were in the way before, but now. We're gonna have a wall. So this building is gonna start here. And we might have, I guess, an opening through here inside the building going to the next area. So we'll leave that as like open like that. Um, and then we like that. You have to go for 15 minutes. Okay, yeah, I'll, I'll probably be done by then, I'm guessing. Um, but I do recommend uh, checking me out when, you, uh, when I stream next time. So this is the edge here. So we'll fill all of this in. Oh, I can't quite reach it. Okay. Um, and we can... Um, how much space do I, do I leave in between this whole thing? Good. I, I left a, an even, even number for my double doors. Awesome. Uh, we come back through and add in um, some of the crack stuff afterwards. Crack bricks. So then this is going to be a regular doorway that allows you to get into... So this will go... So I might actually add arrow slits here. Um, I can do that now, I guess. How close is that to... Okay, yeah. We're, no, we're far enough away. You're new to Mixer. Well, welcome to Mixer. Mixer's a pretty cool... Pretty cool uh, streaming place. Everybody's pretty nice. Um, let's also do... Here, so let's on this side. Why not? A little bit of defensive stuff on the inside. Doesn't hurt. And I guess... I line those up there. I think I might actually switch those. To be on the inside. There we go. That'll be better. Um, put in some torches. And this, I think, probably will have an opening into this neighboring building, whatever this building is. Uh, maybe not double doors. I don't know. Um, but for now, it's like that. And let's make it day real quick. About to end out the stream. Nope, this is uh, only for um, myself and some of my internet buddies. You normally watch me on YouTube. Sweet. That's good to hear. Yeah, I stream uh, right around this time. It's usually, I'd be done usually at this time. Uh, I had a little bit of a late lunch, but yeah. So, um, thank you everybody for stopping by. Uh, thank you, JJ Bonzig, for being a moderator. I really appreciate you.